just under 6,000 people live here in Shiraz. It might be a small town, but they've got some great stories to tell, like how one of the most influential jazz musicians of all time always made sure people knew Shiraz was home. It often passes by without anyone noticing. The sound of every small town. But in Shiraz, South Carolina, they have their own one-of-a-kind soundtrack. Dizzy Gillespie. Dizzy Gillespie. Salt Peanuts. Night in Tunisia. From the Dizzy Gillespie statue in the center of town to the riser in the band classroom at Shiraz High School, Dizzy is celebrated all over. One of the things I always liked is that he always started off his concert or a piece of music by saying, Hi, I'm Dizzy Gillespie. I'm from Shiraz, South Carolina. He'd always mention that he was from Shiraz. Band director Thomas Finnegan has been teaching at the high school for two years. One, two, one, two, three. <laughs> at first, I was going to choose the flute, um, but then I couldn't get a sound out on the flute, so Trumpet was my second option. In the back row is high school senior Chris Esau playing the instrument Dizzy was known for. I think at first, when you first play, it's like, it's kind of difficult. While they have their official band for all the games and events, they're starting something new. The last recorded time that I saw on, on the state's website was 1999. For the first time in 23 years, the high school now has a jazz band. A tradition Thomas was happy to bring back. Music for me is a feeling, so I can hear any piece of music and it can take me to, back to a time or a place. All around the world, Dizzy was known as the king of jazz, but here, He's known as a hometown hero who always remembered where he came from. Thomas said it best, music is a feeling. And you can even hear the jazz band playing right now. The Dizzy is celebrated all over town. They've got the statue behind me. There are banners up here. Alicia, he is just one person. So many people are proud to say he's from Shiraz.